Episode 7. Welcome back to Let's Play Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time. Last time we went through the Neon level, and Cortex has no surprise like betrayed us and has gone back. Back to where it all started. And Cortex Island, 1996, where it all began. And this is where it ends. So let's do this! Secret personal frequency. What? Who is this? This imposter? Do you not recognize your own face? I've come from the future to warn you. If you try to turn Crash Bandicoot into the general of your army, you will fail. The machine rejects him. God, feed, embryo, alert the guards. Uh, why won't I listen to me? Because he's you. Uh. Listen up, lackeys. There's an imposter me on the loose. Identical in appearance. Beady eyes. Lips like two overripe bananas. Skin like a jaundiced mole rat. A bona fide tail. <laughs> you got massive cockroaches. Thick cockroaches. <laughs> I find it funny that you don't even recognize you. Anyway, yeah, this is the final lap. Uh, this one is about as equally as hard as the rest of them. This. Ugh. Makes me sick. kind of stuff that makes your heart beat. Your heart pounds so fast it hurts. Uh, I don't like that kind of stuff, man. It's not cool. Mm. Oh my god! I swear I am... Oh. Uh. Uh. 
this is too much. You think you know what you're doing. This kind of stuff. Ugh. point. Yeah, I think I am. Increase security! Protect your master! Is that what I sound like? Do I have a weird voice? You know, it would be nice. It would be pretty funny if was, they brought in Clancy Brown to do the old Vortex. Because that would have been more sense. But I know it was during the COVID time, so they probably didn't get into it. But, you know, it would be funny if they did brought him in, into voice the past cortex. Ah, uh, missed opportunity, but oh well. I feel like this game. No, I just missed the dialogue. I never know what he was gonna say. So I bet he was just just mocking him, just mocking his voice, and then. It was not my intention! I swear, it was I was not gonna go for that! I was only just trying to jump on the TNT crate and then... See? Just, that's what I was going for, man. That's just being a dick! Wow! Just wow! Oh my god. 
God, I'm actually gonna lose it here. I'm actually gonna freaking lose it here. I want to get the level over and done with. You just want to. <laughs> you just want to. <laughs> uh, let me be done with the level, please. Gem. I got it. <laughs> Let's go already. Toxic tunnels. Yeah. This this is gonna make me feel all toxic. Wally the Womb, Wally the Wombat was gonna be, which was originally going to be, until they just replaced him with the Bandicoot. That's pretty clever. Alright, moving on. Oh good, it's this bit. I can't go like that because I don't have the blue gem. But you have to like... Get... No crate smashed. In order to... Level. But even if you did manage to get all that, imagine doing it all in perfection. It's just... Hell! It's just plain hell! to do and I'm not I'm not gonna do that I'm not gonna waste so much hours of my time doing that did it before never again Ah! 
levels are just going to get harder and harder. Okay, no, 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 I've had enough, no, forget it, no, I'm moving on, no, it's, it's not worth it, man, it's just, it's just not worth it, you're not gonna get the, you're not gonna get that gem anyway, so, I already wasted so much of my time. And I'm not, I'm not gonna waste it. I'm not wasting it. On something like this. Try to like get those. Oh, and cancel. I do to prove myself. Mother's name, Sharon. Childhood pets, wrong with googly eyes. Favorite food, buttered noodles. Butter on the side. Henrio, change the password to my diary. This brute's been stupid. <laughs> Uh. 
I'm a, I'm a lot of work, man. I'm... What is wrong with me? I... What is wrong with me? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm starting to lose my sanity here. I'm losing my sanity here. That's what I'm doing. I'm losing my freaking sanity. <sighs> this is like the last area of the game. Come on. Give me a break. Just let me finish the level, please. I'm not going through that stuff again. No way. Not again. Uh -huh. Let's go. Again. Vortex Castle. Like the one behind the portrait of Grandfather that opens when you press on his triangular fossa? But how? Because it's you, stupid! Seriously, what was I supposed to do with that? Where is something in here?
Got it. Mio's like, oh, forget that, I've seen enough shit. Too many buns, I was... Uh, I, I panicked. I panicked. 
panicked. level to go and that's the let's play I don't want to go through the full completion as I really don't it's for the safety of my own sanity the past unmasked here we go Any idea how stubborn I used to be? Yes. I need to stop him from making you. But I can't kill him because that would kill me. So I guess that means I'll have to kill you. <laughs> oh, you know, kill his past self. Going. Hey, my mask. Did you... Jump on the shootout magic? Cheater! You could just kill uh. this past self. Put it on. You don't have to do the present. Resistance! Help! Stop that! Stop that! Just relax and accept non existence! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. Shoot Omatic! Shoot! Shoot! Whoa. Resistance! Help! Help! Time out! Time out! <laughs> Annihil laser! Fire! Annihil laser. <laughs> I can smell your fleas boiling. No. Whoa. Be careful. I might flip. Ah. Ah. Yes. Your whole world is upside superb. I had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> Assistant, help! Gotcha. You can't keep up the pace. Hmm. Uh. Whoa! Slowing. Ready, set. Cower before Cortex. Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Assistant, help! Help! Rude! <laughs> I'm bored of your shenanigans! Ah, oh, no. That's it. Stop that! Stop that! Persistent, go! Go! Ow! Ah! Uh, I was doing so well. Stop that! Stop that! 
Blast it! Blast it! Persistent! Go! go. For the first time, why can I do that now? Stop that! Unbelievable! I know, it is unbelievable. Persistent, go! There! Got him. Must have taken a hit to the old temporal lobe. But a fallen foe can only mean one thing. It came to blows, and I won! My new general's first order of business will be to dispose of you. <laughs> we are closer than ever before. Quickly, into the vortex. But Dr. Vortex, the vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> Again. Explains a lot. Uh, uh, you <laughs> stay. Uh, what are you going to do to me? <laughs> Looks like somebody needs a little time out. Somewhere he can't cause any trouble. Enjoy the end of the universe. Dine is back and ready for you. Say good day to delectable dishes inspired by my interdimensional travels. Enjoy the breeze with our innovative three-wall dining room design. Dingo's Diner, health and safety rated D for delicious. Warning, D is a failing sanitation phrase and does not stand for delicious. Hmm. <laughs> ah, he's at last. Oh, almost there, almost there, get the yes! Hey, Crash, you're in! Five, four, three, two, one! <laughs> hmm. uh. In memory of Mel Winkler, the original voice of Aku Aku. Uh. This game has been a work of fiction. Any similarities to any marsupials, talking masks, dingo alligator hybrids, or evil science guys with weirdly shaped heads living or dead is purely coincidental. You should not have played this game if you suffer from Wumpa Allergy, Crash Rash, Fear of Alternate Dimensions, Fear of Moving Platforms, Fear of Still Platforms, Fear of Sequels, Fear of Squishy Noises, Fear of Bouncy Noises, Fear of Super Science, Fear of Collecting Things, Fear of 90s Nostalgia, Inability to Comprehend Time Paradoxes, Inability to Forgive Those Who Have Wronged You, Inability to Pick a Restaurant When Someone Asks You What You're Hungry For, Inability to Remember Where You Parked, or a Delicate Tummy. For more information on Bandicoots and their diet, habitat, mating habits, birthday wish lists, and shoe sizes, Visit your local library or ask your grandma. I don't know if she has any prior experience with bandicoots, but she's very wise, and I'm sure she'd love to hear from you. The makers of this game do not in any way endorse eating at Dingo Dial's Diner, which has been known to cause transdimensional discharge, intestinal rifts, wumpa whooping cough, parasitic slime boils, random teleportation into darker timelines, and uncontrollable mewing like a little kitty cat during important business meetings. <gasps> 
any unauthorized exhibition, distribution, or duplication of this game will result in very hurt feelings. And why would you want to hurt our feelings? We've always said really nice things about you. We even said your new haircut looked great, even though it was kind of a weird length for you. Guests of Crash Bandicoot stay at Insane Beach Suites, which is just a log with some moss on it. The moss is really soft, though, so you should be able to get a good night's sleep. What, are you too good to sleep on a log? Sorry, Your Majesty, I suppose you want a continental breakfast instead of a handful of ants that make their nest under the tree. Jeez Louise, there's no pleasing some people! <laughs> Can you give me a minute? <gasps> okay, I'm ready to go again. The events of this game are absolutely 100% canonical. Unless you didn't like them, in that case it was all a dream. Ugh. Finally, thanks, bunch of Craig Smith. Ugh, man. Yeah, that's... Crash Bandicoot 4, it's about time. <laughs> man, oh man. What a nightmare that has been. Don't get me wrong, I do love the game. Trust me, I like it. Good lordy lord. This is challenging. Especially if you want to go for a perfectionist 106%. Good lord, good luck, I'll see you in therapy. <laughs> because I sure as hell am NOT gonna go for the 160%. No, you can't convince me, you're not gonna tell me that I need to do 160%. No, I'm not. I already did that once, never doing it again. But yeah, the challenge is not good, the voice acting was pretty decent, and the gameplay was pretty interesting. The difficulty was all right and fun, even though they were challenging at first, but of course it was gonna be so annoying because I'm bad at losing and I'm totally losing my mind because my brain cells is losing and losing and losing and because I can't go for the distinct Oh, good lord, even I find myself blabbering. Oh. Okay, just... Bottom line, if you like Crash Bandicoot, and if you like Challenge, go play this game. And if you're a perfectionist, go for it. Just, just go for it. I'm not saying that you should go for it, but if you want to, go for it. <sighs> Anyways. Ugh, I'm... I'm starting to lose my mind here. Ugh. Anyways. Now that we're back at the map here, and the only get the only special thing you unlock is well It's this, the triple spin. You spin the button repeatedly. Bad enough make it no thanks! I choose life. I choose life. So I hope you enjoyed this let's play I did. If you didn't like it, I'm sure there's somebody else who played this game. So anyways, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Until then, bye-bye!